removable cast is ideal application that the patient can put on or take off the cast for treatment period. Removable cast can be made with soft casting tapes and core splints manufactured by BL Tech. It helps patients ideal healing and rehabilitation by providing mobility and also immobilization at the same time on the injury part depending on each application. This video will show you removable thumb spica application which is applied when stabilization or support of the wrist joint or thumb joint is required. For patients extra comfort it is highly recommended to apply kneel under pad as skin protection. Kneel under pad allows the patient to take a shower or enjoy swimming while wearing a cast. Kneel under pad is made of aero silver which is 99.9% .9 antibiotic and water repellent so it doesn't make unpleasant odor and itching. Please make sure to instruct the patient to dry up the cast and kneel under pad with a hair dryer once the cast gets wet. Prepare a smaller size of kneel under pad to protect the thumb area and make a 2 cm cut to easily slide it over the thumb. Make a small diagonal cut in the kneel under pad for thumb. Gently roll it on and remove all wrinkles. Since kneel under pad acts as a buffer to protect the fractured limb, no additional padding such as cotton bandage and stockinette is not recommended for ideal performance of kneel under pad. Put on protective gloves before applying the casting tape. Open the casting tape and apply it without the water in order to have enough application time. You may shorten the set time by dipping the casting tape in the water. It is another benefit of kneel cast to be easily unrolled without water. Wrap the casting tape at the wrist and work distally to the hand. Make a two-third cut at the thumb and curl the edges of the casting tape to make a smoother edge and keep applying the rest of the casting tape proximally to the elbow. Open a core splint, dip it in the water and apply it on the body part as needed in order to reinforce the cast. In this application, Core splint is applied from the thumb and radius area. Fold back the kneel under pad at the proximal and distal ends and then create a cuffed ends for more comfortable fit. Now take a second roll and dip it into the water for 10 seconds and squeeze out the excessive water. Start wrapping at the wrist and work distally to the hand and on the thumb area as previously instructed and continue working toward the elbow, overlapping 50%. Make sure to leave approximately one centimeter of kneel under pad exposed to leave a soft edges. Take care that the edge of casting tape is not touched on patient skin. Mold the cast with the palm of your hands, checking for any pressure points that may cause irritation. Separating the muscles of radius and ulna when molding prevents the wrists from getting out the proper position. Hold the patient's hand in an arm wrestling position and finish the molding. Allowing the cast set, cut off the cast along the back side of the hand. You may apply adhesive plaster on the edge of the cut area to prevent the inconvenience. Put on some Velcro as needed. Apply the removable cast and check if the cast fits well to the patient. And now you are done with removable thumb spica.